What's up, everybody? Philip Sadiq. Okay, Philip Sadiq show. Movie review: Captain America: The Winter Soldier. We won't touch into a lot of other things because a lot of you are going to see the film. If you don't, you're missing out. I'm telling you. Believe me. Yeah, I believe. Picks off where the Avengers left off, and it goes into more Steve Rogers' story and his involvement with S.H.I.E.L.D. Mind-blowing at what's going on at S.H.I.E.L.D. I mean, it's all NSA stuff. I mean, they were trying to track people, your DNA, email, your Instagram. And Nick Fury worked with S.H.I.E.L.D. He kind of had an idea of what's going on and what's buried beneath the surface. Steve Rogers, Captain America, because he's trying to adjust in this new world, but still having one foot in the old world. He still has the old music. He still has the... <laughs> the writing pen of all the things he needs to do. And he rem reminisces, and then he visits someone back from the day, like Peggy, who helped found S.H.I.E.L.D. And you could see that they had definitely had a connection there. And when they're talking, and then she goes back to the old days, you could see it really, really, it touched him deeply. But you guys all wanna know about the action. But there's more than action. You have to stay with us. more than action. First Captain America was the skeleton. You have to have the foundation first. This Captain America too, the Winter Soldier, like it lays on the meat, the organs, the blood going through the body. So it's a much more satisfying experience, I would say, watching this particular film. Black Widow, we get to see her emotional range of things that affects her. And we meet the Falcon. <laughs> As Steve, <laughs> he, was getting, he, was getting, he was getting lapped by Captain America and his backstory of why he does what he does. And they have, of course, the jokes, the interplay, all those good things in the film. That makes the Marvel films, I think, one step above a lot of the other franchises who try to, I don't want to say copy, but yes, I'll say copy. And now on to the bad guys. We meet Betrak the Leaper, the French guy specializing terrorism and French kickboxing. Like this is called Savat. And he does a great, fantastic job fighting Captain America. One of the most exciting and sad parts is the Winter Soldier, who was a, who was a ghost, as they say. And then he and Cap finally meet, and, you, and it was just, it, they had to fight. But then you could also see, as I said, the sadness in Steve's eyes because he remembered who this person was. All of you probably know, if you don't know, the Winter Soldier, there are three Easter eggs in this particular film. Normally Marvel does two. This was three. Two are visual. One, you had to really listen, listen, listen real close. When they were saying what these special shield ships would do, target you, I mean, Minority Report, target you, Instagram, all other stuff, follow your DNA and extrapolate if you will be a problem in the future. And then they would just take you out. The guy started naming names. He said, what was I think? Bruce Banner. Then he said, Stephen Strange, Doctor Strange. Maybe, just maybe we'll get to see his character in the age of Ultron, the Avengers, because it looks like they are going to need a whole lot of help. I'm just so excited. I've seen the movie, what, one, two, three times. And each time, I mean, I like it more, 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 more. One thing about the Winter Soldier, whenever he comes into the film, you hear this screeching like your fingernails on chalkboard, like ee! And I can only attribute that to the brainwashing, the sounds of that's going on in his head. It's so confusing. They did so much to him. And all you can hear is that ee! that noise. And then, oh God, I'm not gonna say it, but there's a touching scene when he, Finally tries to figure out who he is. And then you can only hope that he will be in the age of Ultron too. Bottom line, should you go spend your money, should you pay your hard-earned money, stand in the lines that are gonna be there, buy the popcorn, buy the milkshakes. Heck yes, this movie has everything. And for me, the action was great, but more the talking, the conversation, the groundwork was laid. As far as backstories, and how can I forget Mr. Pierce, <laughs> Robert Redford. He plays a real smooth criminal. So I give this movie, shoot, four stars. 
Captain America the Winter Soldier, you have to go experience it for yourself. I'm telling you, it is one of the best Marvel films I have seen. And just go there, be a kid again. So much so, I had to buy a shield. Philip Sadiq, we will see you on the next movie review.